Good blessed it, uh, Saturday, uh, April the 11th, 2020, time being about 8, uh, 58 a.m. 2020, time of the vision. See that old school lawnmower do a, does a good job. I greet all human beings all around the world with a universal greeting of peace and the blessings of God be with you. It doesn't matter what your political, philosophical, personal, nor religious beliefs may be. It doesn't even matter whether you're the richest to the poorest person on the face of this earth. It doesn't matter whether you're the proclaimed toughest to the proclaimed weakest person on the face of this earth. It doesn't matter if you're my family, friends, or my proclaimed enemies. It doesn't matter if you're light-skinned or dark-skinned. It doesn't matter whether you like me, my YouTube videos, whether you give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down. Me and my daughters and my grandchildren and uh, those who follow righteousness, we welcome you thumbs down. We welcome you negative uh, people that's making the negative comments. Have you noticed nobody responds but you all? Have you noticed when you get your likes on your negative uh, comments? Have you noticed is this y'all or you? We pay your comments no mind. We look at them, and when you laugh at the fact or give a thumbs down by my child being in the hospital, while you giving a thumbs down, God giving her a thumbs up. You see, she wasn't named Queen Ramona just to be named Queen Ramona. She's a queen by birth. You see, when you enemies came into my house, when I said my, you enemies, I don't speak of all the Charleston Police Department. I don't speak of all the white people. I don't speak of all the black people. If the shoe fit wear, when you came in my house on May the 19th, a little bit after midnight in 2008, Queen was gone on uh, three years old. But when you took her and her one-year-old sister out by force, got them out of the state and city that they was residents and born in, took them uh, without their will, Queen took charge then at that age, guarding her sister while they was left in the streets. Nurturing her sister when she had a fractured elbow in the streets. Secured her for 70 days and 70 nights. You see, Queen, as she lay in that hospital with one lung full of pneumonia. Not due to something that she did. You know, due to the fact that a medical doctor, after four trips from February of 2020 to just a few days ago, April the 9th, 2020, when she came complaining with the shortness of breath a few times, the gurgling when she inhaled, the continued cough after giving her antibiotics three different times within that period, no blood tests, no squabs, no urine, no x-rays. God allowed her to go through that process for a reason. You see, 
it showed when they took him away, it showed how evil some people can be. The queen was here tonight when I was planting this grass. I was telling her this morning when I talked to her from a hospital bed, I said, it's growing. Can you see it? That's Kentucky 31, it's growing. We watched people roll past when I was planting it, when the night came in. Some things is a joke. You see that water running? You see the grass can't take care of itself. God gave man dominion over the earth, so it's our job. And my dad's dad, my grandfather, may he rest in peace, was born uh, February the 18th, 1892. He was a sharecropper here. Even during the time of racism, he was able to take care of my dad and his other nine brothers and sisters. In 1940, when my biological grandmother passed away, my grandfather was still able to take care of his function until he married again. Satan been trying to throw me off course because Satan to see the good job I'm doing with my two young daughters and my 92 year old World War II honorably discharged veteran day but i want all of my positive followers and god fearing people to know uh i had to make a choice to stay up there with queen and let somebody else attend to my dad and my 13 year old even though she can tend to herself but Queen knew that she was in the environment where me and her felt the spirit of medical doctors and nurses and personnel was going to take good care of her. You can see the ignorant uh, critics making a joke of my sister passing away on March the 18th, 2020. Making a joke uh, of my daughter Queen being hospitalized. You see, my sister reached at almost 70 years old. She did her job and when you do your job, God moves you out of the way. That's something my critics don't know. My critics don't know, my grandmother told me some years ago on my mother's side. She said, when people mock you, you continue to do what God has you to do because those that mock you would be just like the hunter that goes out and hunt a rabbit. Sometime you will see some of them with a rabbit foot over their on a chain around their neck saying that's good luck. But you see, the rabbit don't see it's good luck. The rabbit sees them other three legs that he have is a blessing that the hunter just took one of his legs and not his life. You see, she said, now when you put that in reverse, the rabbit chasing the hunter, it's just like my critics. It won't be no fun when the rabbit has the gun. They wouldn't understand that. A fool despise knowledge and lack L-A-C-K wisdom. You see that blow up? You know, today a white friend of mine came back for those of y'all who said it's racist. We kind of rigged it so I can Pull a little squish to make the throttle go, even though it'll start up. He said, we can buy another cable, but ain't no sister banding, and I can do this here. You see, some people look and laugh at a lot of things 
that they see me do. But God give me breath. He give me wisdom and knowledge. You see that? I'm able to steal even my, my daughter in the hospital. I'm able to steal water, the bird bath, so the birds can take a bath and drink water. I'm still able to take care of the grass. When time come, I'll cut my bushes. All right, now, still able to keep these vehicles up and running. Them motors are more cleaner than the thoughts, the bodies, the minds, and the brains of my critics. You see, they can lie, but they laugh into themselves. And they comments look just like my burn pile. You see, this burn pile is the brain the brains of my critics. You see what it's looking like? And then what's wrong with them is something is missing out of it. You see that? Something is missing out of it. But you see one thing about God. God let me still carry on. God allowed me to still, in spite of, the questions that my enemies ask. Some has been asking, did you go get that letter fingerprinted? Why would they be worried about that? Then they ask, uh, what do you want done to the white female that falsely accused your daughter of stealing in the family dollar store here in Charles, Missouri, Mississippi County at 601 Main Street. What do you want done? They ask a lot of questions, don't they? Then they say, oh, what you need is some sex. How would they know what I need? If they are female, they must want me. If they are male, they probably want me, but I'm not off into males. You know, you have them ask a lot of questions, but you notice lately, I don't even answer. I don't even comment or respond to their comments. And it's just letting them see. Try to get your count over six with your dislikes. You might be able to get it, but you're going to have to make some more mock YouTube channels. You see, my daughter's doing fine. They allowed me to bring her computer. She got a cell phone. All of it's paid for, not with drug money, not with any illegal money. And guess what? It wasn't even bought on the first, or the second, or the third. But let me tell you one thing. As your mind decreases with that infection, me and my children grow just like this grass I planted about a week or so, about a week ago. When you plant grass, you have to do certain things. It needs sunlight and it needs that. Your brain needs oxygen for you to keep on functioning. When the brain don't have oxygen for about 10 minutes, the brain cells begin to deteriorate. And once they start deteriorating, them one particular cells that don't replace itself. You see, my critics' brain cells has most definitely, without a doubt or contradiction, has deteriorated. No matter how much oxygen you give them or give them, they can't recover because God got a place for them. I'm going to leave you with this here. Y'all keep praying for my daughters and y'all keep on ignoring those critics. Peace be still.